head I fear That the thoughts build up until I can't hear That my mind fills up into a creature And it haunts me somewhere much deeper Just to get out of the home, it sucks. I've had enough. I don't want to feel the stuck under the All right. Well, hey, I'm pretty excited to jump in this thing. It is a full bolt on cammed supercharged three valve on E85 with a couple other goodies here. Uh, you might have recognized it from one of my previous videos. But from the previous video, there's nothing really else that's been done to it yet. However, I do have the opportunity to actually get to know the car a little bit better, go out and enjoy it, and really feel how much it pulls as well too. Going into the interior here, you have your typical three valve where it's peeling on the side here, but we got a gauge cluster going up and down so we get all those readings. Um, nice little five-speed transmission. I believe it's still a TR36. 50. Apart from everything on that, there's not much else to explain. Let's go ahead and start this bad boy up. Actuator. E-brake does not work. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and hear it on the outside here. As you can hear, it's got a nice set of comp tams on it. I believe they're, uh, it's a stage two comp cam on the car. There is the blower. Uh, it's also got a smaller pulley as well too. Time to get back into a supercharged three valve. Excited for this. All right. Time to go for a ride in this bad boy. Sounds good under the tunnel. <laughs> that was that was pretty good i don't know if you guys could hear the blower whine there but whoo that was cool all right my turn to drive this thing Pretty excited. Yeah, you know, scoot the seat up because I'm in 5'8, 5'9, maybe 5'10, I don't know. This guy's like 6'2. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I stall this thing or not. Can you just let the clutch out? Yeah, yeah here we go. Just like riding a bike. Doesn't buck nearly as much as my car. That's what's nice. Yeah. Stay tuned, Kim. Damn, it just wants to go.
out, you gotta put it in there more in my car. That was a uh, that was a whole lot of fun. Uh, I don't know if you guys could feel uh, how quick we were moving, uh, but it was uh, it was definitely eating. I think my favorite pull actually was that uh, that third gear pull. You just felt it all the way through. Felt the blower making some some boost. Wow, like this is like it's not even hot. It's not even warm. It's like room temperature <laughs> that's cool that's cool for the most part that's about it i mean I, I don't really got anything else to say about this car other than you know you can make uh you can make some cars fast and this three valve is uh is only it's only a stock bottom end car as well too so he's still got more of a ceiling once he builds a motor here and everything like that but it is it is moving how it's currently set up that is that is 100 for sure um, make sure you follow the owner Gabe uh, he's got he's got some socials I'll just tag him right up here he'll let me know what to tag on there you got anything uh, else to say about the car no nah, it's just it's it's come from it's come a long way uh, the car two years ago was in, a, in really good shape but uh, here she is had a bullet hole right yeah. <laughs> <laughs> had a bullet hole somewhere in the side of the car but yeah. anyways that's uh that's pretty much gonna do it on this bad boy uh it's Lido tune some of you three valve guys will know that stuff uh, ls what that's that's pretty <laughs> funny <laughs> you can kind of have that sticker on a car now especially since he gave me a two car gap at no fly zone here but 
Let me know what else you might want to see on my channel here. It was a pleasure getting to drive this car. Always fun uh, getting to drive other cars here and everything like that, especially when they're not just boring stock cookie cutter. This is really done up in a lot of special ways. So that was fun. Make sure you guys uh, like this video, subscribe to me if you want to see more of this content, and I'll catch you later.